What is NFL Pro Era? Cover stars revealed for new game. NFL Pro Era 2025 builds on its VR experience to add linebacker gameplay, improved realism, and updates, featuring cover athletes CJ Stroud and Micah Parsons. The NFL is again stepping into the video game world of virtual reality with their third installment of the Pro Era game. The official NFL and NFLPA licensed game will see several improvements from its first edition. NFL Pro Era 2025 takes the traditional PlayStation or Xbox controllers out of gamers' hands to deliver the league experience through a VR headset. Instead of mashing buttons to control favored franchises, the game will see its user immersed on the field as either a quarterback or, for the first time, the chance to play as a linebacker. The game will transition to a live service model from its predecessors, meaning it will evolve throughout the NFL season with updates, patches, and more as long as users are connected to the internet. Although a launch date for the game has yet to be announced, gamers who purchased NFL Pro Era or NFL Pro Era 2 will have access to the game for free. Ben Shelton fell in love with another sport before becoming next big star of U.S. tennis. Brittany Mahomes makes feelings clear after backlash for liking Donald Trump post. The cover athletes for the new game are C.J. Stroud of the Houston Texans and Micah Parsons of the Dallas Cowboys. Adding defense and being able to play linebacker was a selling part for Parsons, who admitted to being an avid gamer. I am a huge gamer, especially VR games and football, so being a cover athlete and playing a key role in NFL Pro Era is an awesome experience, said Parsons in a press release for the game. Once I talked with the Status Pro team and they wanted to add defense to the new version of the game, I knew I wanted to work with them. I was thrilled when they wanted me as a feature athlete. On the offensive side of the ball, Status Pro turned to the emerging second-year QB Stroud, who threw for 4,108 yards and 23 touchdowns last season. He completed the eighth most passing yards in the entire NFL as a rookie and delivered the most passing touchdowns per intercepted passes with just five. It's an honor to be one of the featured athletes of an incredible game that mirrors playing quarterback in real life, said the Texans QB. I love what the team is doing at Status Pro, and once we started conversing, I knew I wanted to be involved with NFL Pro Era and the vision they have to be the best VR game. The game's new installment addressed player concerns from previous versions, mainly aiming for more accurate physics, opposing player behaviors, and making the game more realistic with wear and tear fatigue over time. Game mode upgrades will include the traditional exhibition mode, head-to-head -head online competition against other players, and new mini-games. Players can also customize their in-game avatar to build a player that looks and moves like its user. The game also added touchdown celebrations and official NFL licensed gear for players to wear during the game. A new social sports complex will also be added, providing players with an immersive NFL facility experience. The space will be used to connect socially with friends in the game, sign up for in-season tournaments, and connect with other players worldwide. With VR, it's more than just playing a game. Game developer Marcus Matthews said, we're borrowing from real NFL facilities, and we're creating more of what we call a sports complex. We have a multiplayer lounge where if you want to go play in our free play mode, you can interact and meet other people before you jump into a sandbox free play mode, he continued. Plus, we still have our locker rooms, your personal areas, and just a deeper, richer world. And that's going to be one of the foundations is to try and blend gameplay and world exploration you'll see a much more expansive world in the new version. Babudas News